Hi there, and welcome back to the second instalment of the Bike Catalogue's weekly Top Bike. After last week's Trek Madone SLR9 ETAP took the honours, and there's a link below if you haven't watched that video yet, this week is the turn of the Super 6 EVO Carbon Disc Woman's Ultegra. A couple of years ago, Super 6 had a revamp to fall in line with the latest trend of drop seat stays, improved aerodynamics and more comfort. Whilst I think it's a shame as I love the old traditional look of the bike, I think this new bike is still a brilliant option. Cannondale are a brand that offer a lot of value for bike and this Super 6 comes in at £3,950. For this bike, the bike comes with a full Shimano Ultegra hydraulic disc brake setup. Importantly, it includes Ultegra disc rotors, which is often an area that brands use cheaper alternatives. However, slightly frustratingly, the cassette and chain are not Ultegra, which I would like to see at this price point. A smart touch to help with the women's specific geometry offered in this bike is the smaller version, the shift levers. This should be welcomed by most women generally having slightly smaller hands. However, this is something that I would like on more bikes, as even as a rider with a relatively large hand, the smaller shaped shift lever is something I would really benefit from. I know that colour can be subjective, but I like that Cannondale haven't gone for a stereotypical pink or purple for a woman's bike. It's quite common for brands to offer this, but I know that many female riders, they don't actually want a pink bike. The champagne colour is a really smart and I'm a big fan of it. Cannondale have added a semi-integrated bar and stem combination with the cables running neatly under the stem into the front of the head tube. While this makes it difficult to alter your fit if required using aftermarket parts, it does make it look really smart. Cannondale's hologram wheels round off this bike and they are a really good all-round wheel set. At 35mm deep they offer good versatility whilst not being affected by the wind, a common problem with deeper wheels. Overall, this is a bike for someone looking to go fast over hilly terrains, a very light and stiff bike which has a huge amount to offer to anyone riding. This 2021 bike is currently only available on pre-order, but you can pick up the 2020 model for under £3,000, which is a real bargain. Plus, the older model has a normal bar and stem set up, offering more flexibility to the rider. Visit the website to find links where to buy that older model. Let me know your thoughts on this bike in the comments below. And if you found the video useful, please subscribe and like.